basically going to be restricting your own happiness. Everything God designed is beautiful and happy and everything we do, even through restriction, is limiting our happiness. We might not be terribly unhappy, but we're not going to be in the, the state that God designed us to be, ever, if we continue doing it. Graham, you'd like to ask? Um, if we're wrong about who we think our soulmate is, um, is, can that have a bad effect on our progress? Um, well, not if you have an attitude of deconstructing your facade and deconstructing your terror and deconstructing your false beliefs, no. Because it, as you deconstruct all of that, you'll recognise that you were wrong and you'll accept that. So how is that different from not really caring too much about whether you've got is you wish your soulmate or not? Well, not caring means you're in total denial. You have no desire at all to resolve the issue. So one is a state of complete denial of the other half of self. The other is a state of at least accepting a part of the fact that you have another half, even though you're thinking it's the wrong person. You've at least been open to the concept emotionally that you have another half and you're willing to address the issue emotionally. Right? So that tells me there's a, there's a growing awareness that there is another half. Right? If you examine most children by the time they reach teenage years, they want to pair up, right? It's not just addiction that causes that process. It's a part of want, recognizing another half. As adults, we, we go through relationship after relationship that are unsatisfactory, and then we get to the point where we're really in a lot of denial about our relationships, and we're trying to reject the fact that the relationship is very, very important to the happiness in our life. And when we're in a state of complete rejection, complete denial, that's a worse state than it is to be partially aware. Make sense, Graham? You're not happy with that answer? Uh, That's all right. No, we can really. move. We can move on. 